So Nvidia is completely overhauling their entire lineup of GeForce laptops, and one of the biggest changes is their Max-Q GeForce laptops has been the doubling of efficiency across the board. This is achieved through a series of technologies, most importantly of which is Dynamic Boost. This is exactly what it sounds like, a way to power balance in real time per frame between the CPU and the GPU. You see, traditionally, GPUs and CPUs have shared thermals, which means that they share a heat pipe or heat pipes if there's more than one. However, there's a fundamental problem with that approach. It leaves performance on the table because every workload is different. It varies not only from game to game, and not only from setting to setting, but even from scene to scene of the same game with the same very settings. In essence, according to Nvidia, shared thermals don't allow to adopt the kind of bottleneck the system is dealing with, be it the CPU or even the GPU at times, in any given sequence. Dynamic Boost is designed to fix that entirely by looking at every single frame through a bunch of telemetry data to identify the current bottleneck and spend each watt in the most efficient way possible. This results in free performance boost that can range between 6 to 10% in GPU bound workloads. Now, Nvidia clarifies that while at launch, most Max Q GeForce laptops with Dynamic Boost will feature Intel CPUs. AMD CPUs, those are the new Renoir based ones, are absolutely supported. In fact, Nvidia's rep claimed that the company is excited about those upcoming AMD Renoir CPUs that are now slowly trickling out into the market. With Dynamic Boost, this will certainly be a feature on those laptops. Additionally, the feature can be turned off by users through the control panel, however it cannot be simply turned on in older generation laptops through some sort of patch as Dynamic Boost requires new hardware support. Not to mention that Nvidia is doing a per system tuning on each laptop to ensure that they can squeeze every single bit of performance out of it. For more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.